is one of four of my recently completed low temperature differential Stirling engines. You can see from the background that it's cold outside today. It's a January morning in Olympia, Washington. And I'm running the, the engine from the heat of my hand. There's nothing under my hand here. Um, just using the cool air from the outside to cool the top of the motor and my hand to warm it. Now it slowed down a little bit there because I took it off my hand for a second. It's been running about five minutes like this. So this is all handmade. Um, no uh, mill, milling machine, no lathe was used. I did use a bandsaw to make the flywheel with a circle cutting jig. And that was the only real fancy tooling that was required. The diaphragm is made from a latex glove finger. Um, the, the metal parts, the most of the wire and the axles are made from music wire from the model shop. It's been going about a minute and a half now since I started the video. It's still going. The air temperature is just right around freezing right now, and my hand's not incredibly warm. It took a little coaxing to get it started, and I had to pay some real close attention to the diaphragm and get all the wrinkles out. But I am ready to declare this design a success. I'm getting unassisted heat of the hand operation from my low temperature differential Stirling engine. This is awesome. Now I just have to get busy, get that book published so that uh, everyone else can make one of these. This is the smaller of the two engine designs. This collection of four engines has round and square, large and small. The small ones are four inches in diameter and the large ones are six inches in diameter. And surprisingly, the smaller ones are working better for heat of the hand. And I think that's because they fit the hand. The large ones have enough extra surface area on the bottom that your hand doesn't warm it up. So this video has been going about three and a half minutes now. Still seems to be going at about the same pace. There's a view seeing the inside, so the displays are moving up and down. Well, we've made it four and a half minutes since I started the video. And like I said, it had been going for several minutes before the video started rolling. Let's see if we can stretch it out to five minutes. Be good proof of concept. There we go. There's five minutes of video 
running heat of the hand LTD Sterling engine looks like it could just keep going and going and going the environment's really supportive for this kind of operation right now it'll probably keep going until my hand gets cold Starting to slow down a little bit. Well, I wanted five minutes. Here's six. All right, I'll sign off now. Thanks for watching.